Hi fellow DIYers! Welcome back to my channel and welcome if you're new. In this video, I'm going to show you how I made these cute baby shoes. They're perfect as party favors for baby showers or decorations for your nursery. There's a number of things you can do with them. You can also place these in a shadow box frame. So let's get started! Open your Design Space app, click Upload, Upload Image, then Browse. I have the SVG file saved on my desktop, so I'm going to click that. Then click Upload, then click the image that we've just uploaded, then Add to Canvas. Now while the pieces are still selected, click Ungroup. So what we're going to do next is we're going to attach the broken lines to each corresponding piece. So hover your cursor to the Layers panel, and we can see these three lines here. We need to attach them to the piece. Then click that, and those three lines are going to be highlighted. Then press and hold the Shift key on your keyboard. Then click that piece. Then click Attach. And then we're going to do the same thing to this one. You can either repeat the previous step or do it this way. And select those. And as we can see, they're all highlighted here. And then select Attach. So now I'm just checking. I don't have any more broken lines that are not attached. You can now go ahead and click Make It. And then here, since I'm only going to be using the 8.5 by 11 cardstock, I'm going to click the material size and change it to 8.5 by 11 inches. And I'll do the same thing to the other mat. And then I'm going to move the other piece from mat number 3 to mat number 2 because they will still fit in one cardstock. So I'm going to click those three dots and then move object. And then I'm going to select the second mat and then click Confirm. And I'm just going to move it around and make them all fit in one cardstock. And then click Continue. And now as we can see here, we only need two cardstock. And now we can go ahead and select the base material, which is medium cardstock. And make sure you click this mat number one before you press the Go button on your machine. I'm going to use a combination of Aline's Tacky Glue and a Hot Glue. Free fold those tabs. Then apply glue to the outside part of the tabs. And make sure that this hole is aligned to this part of the shoe and make your way around it. And here I'm just going to use a hot glue for this small piece. And I'm just going to use these tweezers to prevent myself from burning from this hot glue.
and there we have it! If you like this video, please hit the like button. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comments below. All feedback is welcome and any feedback is good feedback! Please subscribe to my channel and check out my other tutorials. See you in the next episode of DIY by Sess. Thanks for watching!